Boing Boing readers, my name is Caitlin Scully and I'm talking to you from the ocean drilling vessel, the Joides Resolution. Right now I'm talking to you from near the rig floor, which is where we're drilling down into the seafloor of the North Atlantic to learn more about Earth's climate history. Why don't you take a look at all the cool stuff we're doing on board our two-month expedition. So the Joides Resolution has a 30-member science party from around the world. And this science party really only makes up part of the entire crew that's on board our huge research vessel. There are 126 people on board the Joides Resolution total. That includes our engineers, our drillers, not just our science party, the technical staff. You can imagine it's kind of like a giant floating city block that happens to be doing a lot of science. Our science party is international. We have people from the United States, but then we also have members from Germany and France and China, Japan, Australia, New Zealand, India, members from all around the entire world. So you can imagine just the cultural differences between our world experts, our scientists on board, can lend itself to a pretty interesting uh, experience within the lab. Uh, in the beginning, there might have been some language barriers, some cultural barriers, but really it's great now. Our science party works as a team and we're able to get our science done. The first time I was on the Joides Resolution, I was a graduate student, I was 24 years old, this was now almost 10 years ago, and I was completely and totally focused on science and everything that happened on this ship. And now that I'm older, I'm, I'm married, and I have a, a 10 month old son, you start to think about you know, there's more happening in life now than just what's happening on this ship. This is this is the one I was looking for, for sure. You might be wondering what we do in all of the free time we have on board the JR for the two months we're out at sea. Now, I think a lot of people in the science party might argue that we don't have a lot of free time, but if you have some time to spare, you might head downstairs to the gym, which is really cool. You can also go running out on the back of the ship on the big helideck that we have. Another thing that you might do if you're not feeling quite so active is head down to the movie room. In the movie room, we have a big screen with over a thousand movies to choose from. If you're not feeling too well while you're on board, you can go see our doctor, Dr. Gene. He has a full service hospital here on board, but we like to make sure he's not busy at all. <laughs> and of course, we all have to eat. Our awesome catering staff, they cook four meals a day and always have plenty of snacks out for us. And the food has been really great on this expedition. Now, if you guys want to learn more about the things we do on the ship or more about the science, check out the Ocean Leadership YouTube page and see the videos from Expedition 342.